हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट लॉग इन विथ क्रेडेंशियल्स एंड एक्टिवेट द क्लाउड शेल एंड आई सो मेनी ऑफ यू गाइस फेसिंग द इशू ऑन द टास्क नंबर थ्री सो आई ट्राई टू मेक दिस लैब एज सिंपल एज पॉसिबल आई जस्ट मेक अ लिटिल बिट चेंजेस इन दिस कोड ओके सो आई विल शेयर द लिंक इन डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स ओपन दैट लिंक एंड माई हम्बल रिक्वेस्ट यू प्लीज यूज द ऑनलाइन नोट पैड इंस्टेड ऑफ यूजिंग यूर पर्सनल नोट पैड सो बेसिकली वॉट यू हैव टू डू जस्ट कॉपी ऑल दिस कंटेंट लाइक इंस्टेंस नेम फ्रॉम यूर लाइव इंस्ट्रक्शन पेज and paste over here then copy your port number copy that and make the changes over here like this in the port just paste the port number now for the firewall name just copy that and paste over here like this now for the zone and region what you have to do just simply come on the task number 2 copy this zone carefully do not copy any extra space okay so just copy this zone go back to your documents and paste over here now for the region what you have to do just paste the zone and just remove this dash and some alphabet okay so for me it's c for you it might be a b c d like this so just remove that and this is your zone now what you have to do just copy all this content at a time okay command a or control a like this and activate your cloud shell it will take couple of seconds so please be patient click on got it and run the all command at a time click on authorize and now in the search bar search for the kubernetes engine because what happened when you try to create the kubernetes cluster over here so sometime it stuck and because of that it take more than 10 minute for creating the task number completing the task number 2 so just wait so as you can see your cluster is being created so if you just refresh the page just wait for a second and here your cluster has been created now click on this name and if your cluster will be stuck over here like deploying or health check it's taking more than 5 to 6 minutes so just restart your lab because it's not take more than 3 to 4 minute on a particular task so please be patient and let's see we will get a score or not okay
so it's finally done it's take around five to six minutes and now if i just go back to dashboard and here you can see other commands are running automatically like this so now just wait until this command get executed properly So it's finally done now if you just simply go back to your lab instruction click on the check my progress for task number one you will get a score for the task number two you will get a score without any issue okay now let's check the score for the task number three and it's saying it doesn't look like we have completed the step so no need to worry about that thing because lab take couple of minutes to update the score so just be patient and wait for couple of minutes and after that we will check the score
so as you can see after waiting for at least three to four minutes i got a score so it's not necessary that lab for you it might get three to four minutes sometimes it take more than that but do not worry just be patient and wait for a couple of minutes and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day